Oh, are you? Good. Are you shocked? <laughs> 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 Hi, <laughs> Hi. Hi. <laughs> Camera guy, I saw you. If this video is anything to go by, then Anita Okoye and her husband, Rude Boy P Square, may no longer be heading towards a divorce. But how did they get to this stage? Stay tuned and keep watching. Meanwhile, please make sure to click on the red subscribe button and turn on the notification bell icon to get updates whenever we post a new video. The news of celebrity breakups is not novel in Nigeria. And it's not too surprising for a few engaged big names to call it quits. However, when celebrities whose relationships have seemingly shown no signs of coming to an end abruptly break up with their significant other, that would always come as a shock. The same could be said of Paul Okoye. The internet recently went into frenzy with stories about a divorce case between Paul and his wife Anita, now known as Rude Boy. Paul was a member of P-Square, a now defunct music group he ran with his identical twin brother from 2001 until they split up in 2017. Purportedly over a disagreement about the duties of their manager, Paul and Anita were high school sweethearts and dated for about 10 years before tying the knot in 2014. Their union was blessed with three children, a boy and a set of twins. However, seven years down the line, the marriage seems to have hit the rocks. On Friday, August 20, 2021, a divorce petition purportedly filed by Anita hit the internet, wherein she demands $15,000, about 7.8 million naira, as monthly maintenance support from her estranged husband, stating irreconcilable differences as the reason for their breakup. According to family sources, Anita allegedly starved Paul of sex for five months following a series of minor disagreements, which eventually metamorphosed into something bigger than they could both handle. Paul is said to have started an affair outside their marriage, renting an apartment for his renowned love interest at Ikoye, one of the high-end residential areas in Lagos, Nigeria. This was the final straw that broke the camel's back. While the news is yet to be confirmed by either party involved or their representatives, Paul and Anita have decidedly kept mute on the issue, with Paul refusing to grant any interviews relating to the alleged divorce rumors. Paul's lawyer has refuted the story, claiming not to have been briefed in any way by his client concerning the divorce. The leaked document has neither the court's endorsement nor the date of filing or a petition number. However, it was signed before the Abuja High Court Division. Sources have also revealed that Paul and his wife are willing to co-parent their kids and work amicably through the legal resolutions leading to the marriage's final divorce. Anita, who relocated to the US with their children in April to further her education, is an indigene of Rivers State, Nigeria. Born Anita Toyi Isema on November 8, 1988, she is a lawyer, social activist, and entrepreneur. She also has a master's degree in oil and gas from the University of Dundee, Scotland. On the flip side, Paul, who hails from Anambra State, Nigeria, started a solo music career after separating from his music group. Similarly, a top Nollywood actor, Alexi Kobo, and his fiancée, Fancy, broke up barely three months to their long-anticipating wedding. Rumors about their relationship hitting the rocks surfaced after Fancy unfollowed Alex and deleting their joint Instagram page. She also blocked the actor and deleted all photos of him from her page. While fans of the duo were trying to wrap their heads around the unexpected developments, Fancy announced in a statement on Instagram that she had called off her upcoming wedding because it is important that everyone finds their happiness and live in their truth. Several commentators even suggested that Fancy ended the relationship because she found out that Alex is gay. However, the actor has not openly claimed such sexuality. <laughs> I'm so excited how I have an African prince. Oh, me, I'm excited. Uh -huh. Did you bring something for me? It <laughs> Oh, my God. Oh, oh, baby, thank you. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> oh, my God. The problem is, I don't know if you really robbed me for me or you robbed me for my money. No, I love you. I really love you. Eh? Yeah. How much do you rob me? 
I love you like a fat kid loves cake. <laughs> I love you like a skinny bitch loves a diet. Quizzle. And I love you like Kanye loves Kanye. <laughs> you know Kanye? I don't know. Kanye. Oh. Oh. Yeah. And I want to say, you cannot look in Kandamsha. Oh, yeah. I love you. Yeah. I, I, I love you like a police rob 29. <laughs> I love you like Nepal rob to take life. Oh. I love you like corruption rob Nigeria. <laughs> <laughs> I love you like Yabu boy rob Maga. Oh. <laughs> I love you so much. Oh, I love you. I love you. <laughs> oh. I love you like a Nigerian slow to love. Oh, thank you. I got to big, big cassava. Cassava? Oh, <laughs> yeah, this year, no, just one of them. Yeah. Camera guy, I saw you. Camera guy, I saw you. Hello everyone. If you need the latest celebrity news and information, then you have come to the right place. Please stay tuned and subscribe.